Yeah, man. Pretty much, you got to make this video for them people out there on a the love work level. Man, my brothers, I got to talk to you guys, man, and women too. You know what I'm saying? If you if you do some breakup, like, you know, matter of fact, if you go through a breakup, right, and you do a love work to bring the person back, you got to watch the things you say, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if y'all cats understand, you know, conversation and game, you know what I'm saying? But this is part of the repertoire of bringing your lover back. I mean, yes, you got the stuff working, but you got to know the right things to say at the right time. You know what I'm saying? And also understand what you're saying. See, now I got to become the judge right now. You know what I'm saying? Same way the judge looks at you when you're standing before him in the courtroom is the same way that lover is looking at you when you're standing right before them. Especially if you broke up. You know what I'm saying? Because I got a lot of breakup situations where people, you know what I'm saying, they come to me with breakup situations, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, and when I do the work for them, I hear a conversation. You know what I'm saying? See, the thing about this is, see, this, this is what separates, you know what I'm saying, the black man from other spiritual workers, you know what I'm saying? Because the black man is the father of game. <laughs> let me, let me, let me put y'all people down on game, you know what I'm saying? Because game, Language, you know what I'm saying? Speaking, your conversation. It has to be, it, it has to be soothing to the ears, you know what I'm saying? Rather say soothing to the spirit. You know what I'm saying? Now, if you're talking about getting back with a female, you know, you, you're trying to get her back in your circle. The thing is, there's a statement I learned a long time ago was, it's funny when the rabbit's got the gun. If I call you, I don't know if you want to talk, but if you call me, I know you want to talk. See, this is game. D these are lessons, rules and regulations I got from a mentor of mine years ago. You know what I'm saying? So these key rules, it's funny when the rabbit got the gun, and if I call you, I don't know if you want to talk, and if you call me, I know you want to talk. These are rules and regulations, you know what I'm saying? See, these, these, these are cliches, you know what I mean? But they're very important in the things that I in the, in the things that I speak and the things that I do. Because first and foremost, you gotta understand you don't call a person, you don't annoy them. You know what I'm saying? That's part of the game. You know what I'm saying? Many people think that they're gonna go and force, you know what I mean, force things on their lover. You know, force a relationship out of them. It doesn't work like that. I mean, it's funny when that rabbit got his gun means this. Is that when you get ghost, you used to chase the person. But the fact that you stepped away, now the heebie-jeebie hits them. Or what we used to call the HP back in the day before, you know, social media. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? The HP or the heebie-jeebies. You know what I mean? When it hits them, they start becoming very obsessed and they call you. They run after you. So it's funny when the rabbit got the gun means that now I'm not chasing you anymore. You're chasing me. You know what I'm saying? So all these things have to be taken into factor when you're doing your spiritual work. But now the conversation. When you're talking about a lot, you're giving your lover your you're giving your lover their space. But now your conversation has to be impeccable. Because how can you be like you're giving a person space, but then again you turn around and be like, when we get back together? How fucked up does that sound? You know what I'm saying? If you're talking to a person and you're basically saying that we're not together, and you know you're giving them a space, but you say, when we get back together, huh? You know what I'm saying? So, the analogy I give you is if you're in a court of law and the judge tells you, or ask you, have you, uh, have you basically give up a life of crime? Or have you basically changed in your ways? Now the judge, or the, you know, the judge, he goes back and asks you another question. What would you do if someone hits you? Would you basically, uh, report them to authority or basically hit them back? Now, or no, rather I say, if the judge turned around and be like, if someone took your radio, would you turn around and hit them? Or would you report them to authority? 
Now the person says, I would hit the person. You didn't learn your lesson. You got to understand that your words mean a lot in communication. This is game. This is part of game in, sp in this spiritual avenue. See, a lot of these people, their game is whack as fuck. And that's why their work isn't going anywhere. You know what I'm saying? Because you look at a lot of these, you know, like, you know, a man said, what was it, IG Faye from, what, from Facebook? You know what I'm saying? He basically, he, I forgot the quote that he gave about project, you know what I'm saying? Project spiritual workers, you know what I'm saying? They can do everything, they can work on everything, but they can't work on the quality of their life. But you know what? That's another story. But I'm just saying, these, these so-called spiritual workers talk about love. What type of bitches you had? You know what I'm saying? What type of, see, for me, I, I came up around pimps. I came up around prostitutes. I came up around, you know, escorts. I came up around, uh, you know, um, strippers. So I've been in the game. And not only that, I was in a lot of, you know, I was in a lot of relationships as well as long term relationships as well. You know what I mean? So I know how shit goes. And nobody can't just run game on me just like that. I'm not, you know what? It's like this. This is the analogy it is. You know what I'm saying? The guy at the bar versus the guy, you know, you know matter of fact, this is the, the analogy I give you is a guy at the club, right? There's a guy at the club that females go to just for a drink. You know what I'm saying? Now there's another dude that come in sly, you know, fly as fuck. The females ain't going to play him. Like a John. You know I mean? They're going to look at him like, yo, this motherfucker is supposed to be respected. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to throw that pussy at him. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to try to throw that pussy at him because that motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? He he on top of his shit. Now, you got the next motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? That basically is broke as fuck. And the female is like, you know what? He is square. He ain't nobody. You know what I'm saying? Let me just get a drink from him whatsoever and I'm going to go the fuck home. You know what I mean? So, this is how, this is, you, you know what I'm saying? This is the analogy. You know what I'm saying? You know, when you're square, you don't have that type of, you know, that type of recreation, you know, experience. You know what I'm saying? Your game has to be there in love work. You know what I mean? That's why I love my black clients, man, because, you know, my game is impeccable. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, I can't even say that. You know what I'm saying? The, the point or the Latino motherfuckers, too. The motherfucking game is swift, too. <laughs> Woo! You know what I'm saying, man? I tell you, man, see. Oh, man. You, you listen, I got to let y'all people go, man. Because, yo, you, you, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes y'all clients be making me like, yo, what the fuck is you doing? The shit you saying doesn't even sound right. You know what I'm saying? But other than that, I conclude this video, man. I'll just say this to you guys. You know what I mean? Listen, you got to pay attention to the words y'all saying. You know what I mean? When you, you, you say some things, man, all that shit got to match up. Because either the slightest shit you say incorrectly is going to fuck everything up. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know what I mean? The person be feeling some things, man, but you say the wrong shit. That, you know, you fuck your own shit up, man. So with that said, I conclude this video. Thank you guys for watching.